On the next Wood Songs, we're celebrating our 800th broadcast with Texas troubadours and swing masters asleep at the wheel. Special guest, the Quavey Sisters. You say I'm your honey love. The television broadcast of the Wood Songs Old Time Radio Hour is presented in part by The Martin Guitar Company, making handcrafted guitars since 1833. Online at martinguitar.com. The Lexington Convention and Visitors Bureau, providing information to visit Lexington, Kentucky, online at visitlex.com. By Folkbook, a social media site for arts and music online at folk-book.com and by Time Warner Cable providing cable, telephone, and internet service. Here on the Louisiana Hayride, his name is Hank Williams. The <laughs> From the Grand Ole Opry, Bill Monroe and his Bluegrass Boys. <laughs> Hi, this is Bruce Horns. Hi, this is Kevin Moe. Hey, folks, this is Bela Fleck. Hi, folks, this is Sam Bush. Hello, this is Odetta. This is Joan Baez, and you're listening to the Wood Songs Old Time Radio Hour. And now, gather the family around and sit back in your easy chair. It's time again for the Wood Songs Old Time Radio Hour, our worldwide celebration of grassroots music. Let's welcome folk singer, author, and tree hugger, Michael Jonathan. Dark as that stormy night and so black as the sky How I wish I was in Abilene Nice and warm and dry Weep all ye little rain Whale winds wail All along, along, along The Colorado Colorado Trail. 
and welcome to the Historic Lyric Theater here in our hometown of Lexington, Kentucky. We're at the crossroads of America's folk and bluegrass music, the gateway city to the beautiful Appalachian Mountains. So much art and music uh, happens on this stage. Artists come from all over the world, all over North America. To be here, you don't have to be famous to be on Wood Songs. You just have to be very, very good. We're broadcasting from Australia to Ireland, New Zealand to New York, Yuma, Arizona to the Yukon in northern Canada, celebrating all kinds of great grassroots music. And we're going to pretty much dedicate this broadcast to a certain fella. He was born in 1905. He was the first of ten children. His father was a champion fiddle player while raising cotton on their Texas farm. He learned the fiddle and mandolin as a young boy and he used to hop freight trains around America once he learned how to play the fiddle to get jobs and stuff. Finally gave up to become a barber a barber in Turkey, Texas, of all places. But he's one of the few artists inducted in both the Country Music Hall of Fame and the Rock and Roll Hall of Fame at the same time. This is him. It's Bob Wills, the great Texas troubadour, and his song, New Antoni San Antonio Rose. New San Antonio Rose, honored with a Grammy Hall of Fame award, none other than Bob Wills. Bob Wills, the great Texas musician, is the subject of this entire album called Still the King, here to introduce one of Bob Wills' great songs called I Hear You Talk, and please welcome, in tribute to Bob Wills, the great Asleep at the Wheel and the Woods Songs, Old Time Radio Hour. Yes, I 
on their CD, Still the King. I hear you talking, the great Emily Gimbel on piano doing lead vocals, a mighty fine job. And Jay Reynolds on the clarinet solo. And of course, we have singing back there and playing guitar, the founding member of Asleep at the Wheel. Let's say hi to Mr. Ray Benson. Howdy, how y'all doing? So, so, Ray, before we can talk about Bob Wills, let's talk about Asleep at the Wheel a little bit. Okay, okay? I'll do you're, that. You're, you're, a, you're, a, you're a very tall young man in Philadelphia going after a basketball uh, scholarship, right? Well, no. <laughs> I mean, you know, I played basketball, but I always played music. But you realize you're in basketball country here. Well, so yeah, you well, you know, of course, you know. I, uh, and good luck uh, uh, to the team, unless this is going to air afterwards. But uh, certainly, good luck to the. It'll be to post the forty yes. oh. Right. It'll, this is post forty oh. Yeah. So you. <laughs> so, but you make your way to uh, West Virginia, Paw Paw, a little town in Paw Paw. Paw yeah, Paw Paw, West Virginia. Well we, well, we were in the suburbs of Paw Paw. The suburbs. <laughs> <laughs> up, up the hill in the mountain, we had a little farm and. Uh, I don't know what we were thinking. We were, it was 1970, and uh, we just decided to get out of the city and farm, but we were terrible farmers, and uh, so we played music. So you may play So tell me about the birth of Asleep at the Wheel as a band, because that's where it happened. You know? well, yeah, and uh, Lucky and Leroy and myself decided we'd rope a few people up, my brother and whatnot, and one day a, a, a bus full of hippies came by and said, hey, you're a band, and they, we said, yes, we are. We said, Would you come on down to Washington, D.C. and play a concert with uh, Yorma and uh, Hot Tuna and uh, Stone Ground and Alice Cooper. Just like that. Yeah. It's like the stars somehow aligned yeah. in Paw Paw of and, all places. And, yeah, and <laughs> believe me, uh, we were just sitting there and these uh, psychedelic painted buses came by. I said, you want to go to Washington, D.C.? So, well, heck yeah. <laughs> so there we went and, and, uh, and uh, the rest, as they say, is confusing. It's confusing. <laughs> so so well, let's talk about the confusing part because from, from Paw Paw and your gig in Washington, D.C., yeah. you, you end up going to California. Commander Cody and his Lost Planet Airmen, our good friends, uh, mm -hmm. heard us and uh, took us out to California, right. where we were ensconced in Oakland, California, and played. The, there was a wonderful scene with Dan Hicks and the Hot Licks and Commander Cody and so you were part of all Clover of that. Clover and Huey Lewis and all our good buddies. And then and Willie Nelson said, "Well, yeah, I met. Uh, we played in Austin, Texas, in 19 uh, in the 72, early 73, and they uh, met Doug Somm of Sir Douglas Quintet and Willie Nelson and." Uh, Willie said, uh, you're tall, you play Texas music, you ought to be here. <laughs> <laughs> so, Sounds like a great, great formula, right? Yeah. Well, I, we're we're going to talk more about that as we go on. But right now, let's, uh, we're, we're going to head into our conversation on Bob Wills, your dedication to his music and your pioneering, introducing his, uh, his music to a whole new generation with a brand new album release called Still the King. It's dedicated to the music of Bob Wills. This is a tune called I Can't Give You Anything But Love. It is Asleep at the Wheel on the Wood Song. And this Katie Shore.
That's the only thing I'm plenty of, baby. Dream a while, scheme a while. You're short to find happiness. And I guess every little bit of thinking, every word of it. Lucky day, no darn well, baby. I can't give you anything but love. Let's go play, everybody. their new release, Still the King, a tribute to uh, Bob Wills and the uh, Texas Playboys. We're talking to uh, Ray Benson, of course, about uh, your fascination with uh, Bob, M the, the, the string music of Texas. Um, did it start when you were in West Virginia? I mean, were, was your dedication to Bob Wills starting then? No, no, no. I, I grew up, I played all kinds of music, but I love fiddle music. I played a little square dance bands on the weekend in, in New England. And I played in rock and roll bands, jazz bands. I played tuba in the marching band. <laughs> now, folks, don't laugh about the tuba player. See, that's what you mentioned tuba and they laugh. Tu I don't know tu why. <laughs> tuba and banjo. Those two yeah. things are. are well, uh, you know, there's plenty of jokes which we'll skip tonight. <laughs> Thank you very much. Anyway, and I just loved all this music. And uh, when I was about 16, I really, I, I finally figured out that this, I knew the songs, knew San Antonio Rose and, and, and Faded Love from Patsy Klein and other people, but. All of a sudden, I went, wow, this is the kind of music that you can play blues, jazz, swing, country music, fiddle tunes, cowboy music, etc., and uh, wear a cowboy hat. Well, a lot of folks uh, credit, <laughs> they credit Bob Wills, uh, you know, uh, Bill Haley, Buddy Holly, Elvis Presley, Paul McCartney, Eric Clapton, you guys, Asleep at the Wheel, all, all credit Bob Wills as a huge inspiration for their music, for what they've done. Very few in the new, in a younger generation know who he is, though which is the value of an album like what you've got now. Well, yeah, although a lot of the musicians, you'll notice on this album, we have the Avet Brothers. We have the old Crow Medicine Show, uh, Pokey Lafarge, mm -hmm. uh, Amos Lee, uh, Kerry Rodriguez. There's a lot of young folks. Uh, right here, uh, you mentioned Emily Gimble right here is a, a, a young folk. <laughs> <laughs> and I, I have to mention that her granddad, uh, Johnny Gimble, taught us so much of what we know about music. Yeah. The great fiddler. Yep. And... Uh, it was one of the fellas that, that early on played on, uh, met him before we made our first record and it would help us out. All the old Well, fellas. didn't you even, you, the, the album was recorded with one of Bob Will's band members. Which one? The first one? <laughs> Second one, third one, yeah. yeah and the sixth one, and the eighth one, and the twentieth one. So in other, one. in other words, there's a lot of... Uh, there, there, you, you, on this album, there are two fellas, uh, Billy Briggs, 92-year-old sax player, 92 years old, playing saxophone still, and Leon Rausch, 88 years old, who sang with Bob and sings on this record. And they're on this, on yeah, this album. That's, 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 what I, that's what I was getting I'll to. I'll help you out here. It's good. Thank you. <laughs> I, I often need help. It's okay. <laughs> so, so the purpose of this record, though, I mean, you have a lot of these really cool Americana roots rock type of artists on here with you, but you're, you're really reintroducing Bob Wills to new listeners. Yeah, yeah that's the idea. And part of it is by inviting uh, artists like who's going to join you now. Absolutely. The, from, from Texas as well, there are three sisters that play uh, fiddle together, the Quaby sisters. They've been on Wood Songs once before. We're yep. going to get into a song where they are joining you on stage, then we're going to get to talk to them afterwards. Fantastic. All right, let's get into it then. It's from the album Still the King. Quaby sisters are going to join them. It's a tune called Navajo Trail. It's a sleep at the wheel on the Wood Songs, Old Town Radio. <laughs> Every day. 
day along about evening when the sunlight's beginning to pale I ride through the slumbering shadow along the Navajo Trail late at night the crickets are calling and coyotes A smoldering fire along the Navajo Trail. I love to lie and listen to the music while the wind is drumming a sagebrush guitar. While over yonder hill the moon is climbing, it always finds me wishing on a star. What do you know? It's morning already There's the dawning So silver and pale It's time To climb into my saddle And ride The Navajo Trail Let's ride! Hilda, Sophia, and Grace, the Quaby sisters, joining asleep at the wheel on the CD, Still the King. So what we've got here, let's talk to Hilda for a second. What we've got here is if, if Ray Benson dated the Andrew sisters, <laughs> they, oh, they, <laughs> his offspring would be kind of like you guys. I mean, just... I guess, Maybe yeah. taller. Maybe we taller. would be taller. <laughs> we would be taller. So let's talk about your, uh, your, your background. You're from the Fort Worth area. You're in Dallas now, but you're from the Fort Worth area. Yeah, we are. Three sisters playing, playing fiddle, and, and it's very much that Texas-style, Bob Will-style fiddle, yes? Yes, we grew up playing in a lot of fiddle contests and uh, played a lot of Texas-style fiddling, and then we were introduced to Western Swing, and uh, we just fell in love with it. I remember the first tune that we ever worked up together, I think, was Faded Love. And uh, then we learned San Antonio Rose, and the rest is history. <laughs> so so for those who don't know who Bob Wills is, which you, you're part of a Sleep at the Wheels uh, album tribute to Bob Wills, right? Yes. You know, why is he important? So there's all kinds of classical violinists and stuff out there that would not even have a clue who Bob was. So, so why should they look into him? Why should they get this album? Why should they listen to your stuff, the, the Texas Swing stuff? Well, you know, I think of Bob Wills as kind of like the Bach of Western Swing. He just created a style, and he was such an innovator. He, he was a really, really interesting musician. He was, a, he was a fiddle player, he was a singer, but he really had a mind for a band leader. And he knew how to put together so many musicians and create a sound that's just, to me, it's just legendary, and it's just a, such a big part of American culture. Kind of like Ray Benson does yeah, with the Sleep at the Wheel, exactly right? right. Very, very much the same. Well, you guys are, are artists on your own right, and you're joining Asleep at the Wheel on some of these tour dates, which is how we all got together tonight. Yeah, yeah. yeah. 
So you have a new CD. It's called Every Witch Away, and you're going to do a tune from the album. It's, uh, it's called, well, it's the title cut, so exactly. <laughs> that makes my job easy, doesn't it? Every Witch Away is the Quaby Sisters from Texas on the Wood Songs. One, two, three. Three. From their CD, Every Witch Away, that was the title cut, the Quay Bay Sisters, joined by two other sisters, Penny Lee and Katie Lou Clark, and the great Dave Miller on bass. We're going to be back with the Quay Bay Sisters with more music in the second half hour. Ray Benson and Asleep at the Wheels tribute to the great Bob Wills, and wait till you meet this week's Wood Songs Kid. We'll be back right after this. Mighty fine in the great big western howdy. I'm Ranger Doug. I'm Woody Paul. And I'm Too Slim with Riders, Riders in, in the, the Sky. Sky. And you're listening to the Wood Songs Old Time Radio Hour because it's the, the Cowboy way. way. Thank you much, uh, Riders in the Sky. Welcome everybody to our broadcast coming to you from the stage of the Historic Lyric Theater in our hometown of Lexington, Kentucky, broadcasting worldwide on over 500 radio stations. The show is also airing on American Forces Radio Network. That puts this broadcast on the air on 173 nations worldwide, plus every single military base in the world, plus every single U.S. naval ship in the world, and every Coast Guard vessel in North America. And as always, we want to say hello to all the men and women out there that are working very hard. Right now is a very favorite time of the broadcast for me because we pick a kid performer from somewhere around the country to come on our stage. When you have all these legendary artists and the up and coming monster musicians like the Quebe Sisters and the Sleep at the Wheel and stuff, we pick a scared little kid from somewhere <laughs> in North America and we found a young fellow that we think is just delightful. He's 11 years old from Henderson, Tennessee. Let's say hello to Zane Bolton. How you doing, Zane? Real good. You're doing real good. Now, you you love uh, uh, country and Western music and stuff. You're here with a hat, and you got your boots and your acoustic guitar, right? At, at 11 years old, wh when did you start listening to this kind of music? Well, I grew up around music. My dad and my granddad always played, and then 
I got inspired when I went to the Grand Ole Opry and met Mr. George Hamilton IV. Ah, right. Well, you lost him a few months ago, but he really affected you a lot, didn't he? So what was it about George Hamilton's performance that a young, I guess at the time, 10-year-old little boy, what affected you? What, what impressed you? Well, he was just really nice. I got to meet him. And then he sang a song called Abilene, and I was really inspired, and it just, something told me, I just, I want to do this, you know? So why not like electric guitars and, and spandex and stuff like that? I mean, why, why, you know, you're doing the country music thing like George Strait would do, right? So why does this affect, why does this attract you? There's just something about that sound. It's just so beautiful. There's nothing like it. Well, I like that answer. So we're going <laughs> to, that's a good answer for 11 years old. Well, let's give you a chance to play your song. Okay, you heard uh, George Hamilton the fourth play at first on the Grand Ole Opry, right? So well, let's, I guess we could dedicate it to George. What do you think? Is that a good idea? It's a good idea. All right. The song is called Abilene, 11 years old. Zane Bolton from Henderson, Tennessee. Have fun. This week's Wood Songs kids, Zane Bolton, 11 years old from Henderson, Tennessee. We're so proud of these kids. If you've got a, a youngster that you think belongs on our stage, we'd love to hear from you. You can send me an email and perhaps a YouTube clip, something simple. Send it to michael at woodsongs.com. You can visit our website, woodsongs.com. Click on the kids page. Let's get uh, Ray Benson to uh, come forward for a second and, and get your take on things. I mean, Asleep at the Wheel using this... Uh, using this music, and we're, we're seeing it with the Quaby sisters as well. This is really uniquely designed to dance to, to have yeah. fun with, right? Yeah, e everything from breakdowns to waltzes, shottishes, uh, uh, ethnic dances, uh, and jitterbug, and two-stepping, and you got it. And, and a lot of folks, you know, they hear, you know, Bob Wills is in the uh, Country Music Hall of Fame as well as the Rock and Roll Hall of Fame. I mean, his song, Ida Red, was the basis for Chuck Berry's Maybelline. I mean, he... he well, he, he brought drums and, and electric guitars and, and a swagger to country music that wasn't there. You know, I knew Roy Acuff and, uh, one time backstage at the Opry. We were talking about it, and he said, you know, the difference between him and Bob, they were good friends, was that Bob played for dances. And uh, Roy said, I play mostly churches and schoolhouses and, uh, and that sort of thing. He says, down in the deep south, dancing was a sin, so he couldn't do that. <laughs> <laughs> well, let's, uh, let's hear some of your sinful music here from Bob Wills. <laughs> From your album called Still the King, this is a tune called Girl I Left Behind Me. It is a sleep at the wheel on the Wood Songs, old time radio. Line.
see my wife. Along came a fella really hit me in the cellar and it almost took my life. Oh, that girl, that pretty little girl, the girl I left behind me. Rosy cheeks and a curly hair, the girl I left behind me. great album called Still the King. It's a tribute to uh, Bob Wills. If you want to know more about this album, Asleep at the Wheel, the tour schedule. If you want to hear the show that you're listening to on the radio again, you just visit woodsongs.com. Click on the archive page. This is show number 800 that we have done. 800. Very proud of that. And uh, we also want to give some props to Katie Shore playing fiddle on that last song and Dave Sanger on the drums in the back. So, so Ray, uh, 1974, you got a top 10 record, you're living in a little house, and the bus driver is making more than you are at the time, <laughs> yeah. right? So you, you have really, I mean, you've really had to persevere and stick to it to keep this band together. You're the, the, the last remaining founding member of the band still. <laughs> yeah. Yeah, I was... Couldn't do anything else, you know, and so I figured, you know, it's always been fun, and there've been tough times. There's been, uh, but uh, you know, the tough, the, the tough times just make the good times seem a little better. I wanted to tell this young man, you know, that we backed up uh, George for a whole European tour. It was about three or four years ago, and mm -hmm. he's a good friend of mine. And he did a great job. Didn't he do good? <laughs> yeah. Got it. When you guys started out in the early 70s and there were record deals and stuff like that, Young Zane is coming up at a time where the music business has really changed a lot. I mean, more and more artists are putting their own stuff out instead of signing to yeah. labels. And th there's very few stores left to put the CDs in for people to come buy them. I mean, things have really changed a lot. What hasn't changed is going out and playing for the folks. And that will always be what we do. And so that's, that's the deal, you know. We go, we go all over the country, all over the world. And and sometimes we make a little money on the, on the uh, CDs and, and records, and, and we do make records, too. <laughs> <laughs> There's nothing better than a great artist, a great song, and a great audience. And let's give them something from your CD, Wheeling and Dealing. This is a great tune called Miles of Texas. It's miles a sleep and at the Miles of Texas. Some miles and miles of Texas, all this 
stars up in the sky. I saw miles and miles of Texas. Into Austin, the cradle of the West. Just ask any cowboy, he'll tell you it's the best. I met a Texas beauty and I got friendly with her paw. I looked into her big blue eyes and it's what I saw. I saw miles and miles of Texas. All the stars up in the sky. I saw miles and miles of Texas. Started taming Broncos, I made every rodeo Till I met a tough one, his name was Devil Joe I grabbed hold of his bridle, tried to ride this old outlaw He threw me from the saddle, boy, this is what I saw All right, I saw miles and miles of Texas All the stars up in the sky I saw miles and miles I'm gonna live there till I die. All together, fiddle ride. I saw miles and miles of Texas. I'm gonna live there till I From the CD Wheeling and Dealing, Miles of Texas, Ray Benson and the uh, great band Asleep at the Wheel. That, Ray, I know we're, we're, we're in a different album at the moment, but I want to I go back to uh, Still the sure. Kingdom. There's so many great artists performing on the album with you, and uh, there's a lot of groups that, that are still keeping the uh, spirit of this Texas swing music. Bob Will's alive, you know, Quaby Sisters are doing great, you guys are doing great. There's a band in Nashville called the Time Jumpers. Yeah, they have this young, uh, young country singer named Vince Gill. He's going to do okay. <laughs> yeah, yeah. If he practices some, he'll be fine. There was a, a wonderful singer, uh, Dawn Spears, in that, in that Dawn album. Dawn Sears, yeah. Sears. And, and, and you have one of her final performances on this Yeah, song. we did Faded Love with the Time Jumpers with Vince Gill. Ranger Doug uh, sang yeah. it uh, on it. I did uh, Elizabeth McQueen. We had a wonderful thing. And, and Dawn, uh, we knew she had cancer, and she'd been going through chemotherapy. So we right. dedicate the uh, Faded Love loved her every day. What a wonderful lady. And her husband, Kenny, played fiddle on that, too. Yeah, and, and such a great, uh, yeah. great people. Thank you for mentioning that. I knew that. that. Yeah, I knew them. What do you hope folks, uh, when, they, when they hear a sleep at the wheel on stage, it's, it's obviously feel-good music. It's not a feel-good time most of the world is in right now. So, I mean, this, this sort of gives them a, 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 a chance to, like, just break away from... <laughs> Yeah, when you got troubles, you need the place to go that is not troubled. And, uh, you know, music will take you there. And that's what we hope to do every night. And it certainly helps us. And, uh, but that's, what it's, that's our message. You know, whether you're dancing or listening, music will, will make you uh, go to a place that is uh, universally peaceful. Mm. Well, that's very deep for a tall man. <laughs> The uh, the uh, uh, thing that I was thinking too is is you know what a great message from a experienced messenger like yourself, but what the messenger has to go through to give that message is not always uh, very apparent. I mean, you're you're a you're you're a dad, you're a family man, and to be on the road and to keep asleep at the wheel together, I mean, you've had to make personal sacrifices. 
Yeah, but, you know, so does a traveling salesman, you know, so. so. I figure, I always felt I had the best deal there was. They said, uh, they said, boy, it's tough, you know, you got to drive over here. I said, yeah, beats working, you know. <laughs> <laughs> you know, we, you have to love what you do and, and, and whatever. You know, the, the kids come to me all the time. Parents say, my son's a musician, my daughter's going to. I said, well, can you give them advice? I said, love what you do and, and realize that that's the greatest reward that you can get is loving what you do. Uh, so many people go into work every day and, 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 and dread it and we just can't wait for retirement and and they asked Willie Nelson he's 82 they said when are you going to retire he said well let's see I play golf and music which one should I quit <laughs> <laughs> well God bless them and yourself too because you've been at this for over four decades with uh, sleep at the wheel Thank you. congratulations with on all that. these folks I couldn't do it without all of it and a hundred of folks that's been in this and Thank you all for, for giving us a place to play. Well, thank you for being here, and we're glad to celebrate the new album with you. But we're going to dip back into your uh, uh, legacy of music with a great song that uh, you're well known for. The tune is called Route 66. It's a sleep at the wheel on the wood song. Get Don't your kicks me. on Route 66. Look out, Emily's going to turn that boogie woogie piano loose. Thank you, Ray Benson. Wasn't it great having a sleep at the wheel on our 800th broadcast for Wood Songs? Also from Texas, the Quaby Sisters. Grace, Sophia, and Holder. Thank you, guys. And from Henderson, Tennessee, 11 years old, Mr. Zane Bolton and his guitar. What a wonderful night of music. 
You know, when we get to, to do a show like Wood Songs, 800 broadcasts, all volunteer run, we're so proud of the volunteer crew that puts this show together. <laughs> to be able to have friends like Asleep at the Wheel and the Quavy Sisters come on, be able to introduce kids like a young Zane Bolton. You know what the driving force of the arts is? People make this huge mistake and they think it's, a, you know, it's the making of the living, pursuing the money, the fine... It's love. What Ray said is absolutely true. Love is the greatest transaction of the arts. It's more powerful than anything. It is the best business plan in the world. When artists have to pursue their dream, they're not doing it for any other reason except that they love it. From the hills and hollers of Paw Paw, West Virginia, and they have an idea and they put a band together. You know, this has been the one band that Ray has had his entire adult life, and he has made this sucker work. <laughs> Quaby sisters practice and perform and they're on the road because they love it. We have these young Wood Songs kids like Zane Bolton. He's not here for any other reason in the world except he loves to play and sing. That is the greatest transaction of the arts. Love. When you are out there as an audience, you're part of the great holy connection between the arts and the artists. It takes a great artist, it takes a great song, it takes a great audience, and the thing that ties you all together is love. So when you're out there and you see this new artist in some coffee house or at a festival and hardly anybody's listening, give him the greatest gift of love you can. Stop, listen, and thank them. My name is Michael Jonathan, I'm a folk singer, I am a log cabin dweller. Thank you for show number 800, and we'll see you next time on the Wood Songs. You've been listening to Woodsong's broadcast number 800. Michael's opening song was Colorado Trail from the Walden CD featuring Melissa Deaton, Jonathan on vocals, Isaac May on mandolin, Aggie Clickspeed, Maggie Lander, and Sarah Payne on violin, Steve Rickel on viola, and Bob Ryan on bass. Our chief Thank you for tuning in. There are so many talented artists that appear on our stage. It's very hard sometimes to pick the ones that appear on our TV broadcast. So what we're going to do is leave you with a performance from our huge online archive of past shows. We'll see you next time on the Wood Songs Old Time Radio Hour. Wahoo, boys. <laughs> one, two, I want to take four. Can I get a big wahoo? Give me a horse, a great big horse, and give me a buckaroo, and let me wahoo, wahoo, wahoo. Give me a ranch, a big pair of pants, and give me a Stetson, too, and let me wahoo, wahoo, wahoo. Give me those wide open spaces. I'm just like a prairie flower, growing wilder every hour. Give me a moon, a prairie moon, give me a gal that's true, and let me wahoo, wahoo, wahoo. Did Cleopatra say to Anthony when they met? She hollered, Wahoo, Wahoo, Wahoo. I heard her. And what did Roman Romeo yell to Miss Juliet? Stella, Wahoo, Wahoo, Wahoo. It started way, way back in Eden. Miss Eve was a cause and it's no fib. She wahooed at him for a rib. What did Popa hunt to yell the minute she saw John Smith? Wahoo, Wahoo, Wahoo. Wahoo, boy. Show the rodeo. I like those wood songs too. I like you. Yes, when them guys green cacti, they stand around six foot two. They generally give me a wild bronco. Hey, I want to be a cowboy too, so I can ride the whole day through. Well, give me the length, the size, and strength, and give me Roberta too, and let me wahoo, 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 wahoo. wahoo.
like a monkey handles a peanut, I tell you. Closed captioning provided by the Deering Banjo Company. The television broadcast of the Wood Songs Old Time Radio Hour is presented in part by the Martin Guitar Company, making handcrafted guitars since 1833. Online at martinguitar.com. The Lexington Convention and Visitors Bureau, providing information to visit Lexington, Kentucky online at visitlex.com. By Folkbook, a social media site for arts and music online at folk-book.com and by Time Warner Cable providing cable, telephone, and internet service. <laughs>